guys, what's up? Well, girl, welcome back to my channel. I'm Zoe Grace, and for today's video, I thought I'd do a cool little Q&A, and this is going to be my first ever Q&A. So I posted uh, on my story for people just to send me a bunch of questions, so a lot of my friends sent me tons of questions. So yeah, I'm going to be reading you guys a lot of them today, and hopefully you guys can get to know me better. So let's just get on with the video. Okay, so the first one is, what do you typically do when you go out with your friends? When I go with my friends, I usually go to the mall or we'll go shopping at like Target or something. And sometimes I'll have them, um, like I'll have like a sleepover and then I'll get like a basket and like go get tons of candy and snacks at the store. So we have like tons of junk food and it's the best thing ever. So yeah. <laughs> The next one is what are your favorite makeup products? I'm not really sure if they meant like my favorite brands, makeup makeup brands, but they didn't say that so they said products so I guess they mean like, I don't know, <laughs> um, but like my favorite things I like to use. Well I really like eyeliner and mascara and I always want to put on like, I always put on like a little bit of lip gloss or something and but yeah if there was like one thing I could use, like one makeup item I'd use, it'd be mascara. For sure. Okay, the next one is where is your favorite place to online shop? Um, honestly, Urban Outfitters always has really good online deals, so I always like to shop on there. And um, Kohl's, I, they send you like Kohl's cash and stuff, so you literally get like free cash to. Um, this is not sponsored. <laughs> like you actually get free cash to like spend on Kohl's stuff, so that's really cool. But no, for real. <laughs> but yeah, and then I'm trying to find like some new websites that I that I like to use. But right now, I think just like Urban Outfitters and Kohl's. The next one is what is your dream car? Um, a white Jeep or a yellow Jeep, one or the other. But like I want it like a soft top so you can take off the top of the Jeep, even though they break down easily. Like Jeeps, I know Jeeps break down easily, but I don't care. I want one so bad. <laughs> Okay, the next one is, have you ever snuck out? I have not snuck out because I am a good child. <laughs> not. Um, but no, I haven't snuck out. Plus, we have alarm systems, so... And I don't have my license, so, like, where would I go? I'd walk down the street. I guess I could have a friend pick me up, but, like, I, like, no. <laughs> I haven't snuck out. Yeah, because if we have alarm systems, so if I turned off the alarm, it'd be very loud because my parents' alarm system is in their room, so it would wake everybody up, and I'd get caught, and, like, I don't want to die, so I have not. Okay, the next one is, what is your favorite color? Honestly, I can't just pick one, but like, I'm really obsessed with hot pink right now and baby blue, as you can see from my lights. And I really, okay, I have like a bunch of favorite colors, okay? I'm gonna just list them all down for you. I like lavender purple. I like hot pink. I like peach pink, like peachy. Why did I have to go into detail with that? I like baby blue and I like light like pale yellow so i have five favorite colors i can't really just pick one i like them all um that's just me though i can't decide so <laughs> are you single yes i am in fact single <laughs> what kind of hairstyling tips would you give for thick hair honestly whenever i don't feel like messing with my hair i just braid it and then um like i let it down and it's all curly and then i don't have to like curl it i can literally just braid it and leave it in overnight and then it'll be nice and like curly and wavy and cute um, but yeah, that's what I usually do. Sometimes I just put it in like a bun. I don't know if I, if I don't feel like messing with it. Like I don't really have curly hair, but my hair is kind of thick. So when I don't feel like messing with it, I usually just braid my hair. But that's pretty much all I do. <laughs> what series are you binging right now? I am currently binging Gossip Girl and I, oh my gosh, it's amazing. I know it sounds so stupid, but like you guys just have to watch it. Just take my word for it. Just, just watch, just watch like at least an episode and... I watched it thinking, mm, I don't know, it could be dumb, but it could be good, and I, I I, love it. I can't stop watching it, so it's a problem. But yeah, that's what I'm binging right now, so totally recommend. Things you do in quarantine. Um, I honestly, like, I usually try to go for a walk or maybe a run. I'm trying to get back into shape, so I'm trying to go on runs more often, and then um, I, we got, like, new swings put in that my dad put in outside, so I've been going on the swings and, like, kind of just hanging out outside a lot. And then I've been filling up my bullet journal a lot because, I don't know, it just keeps me busy. And sometimes just listening to music is just awesome. And I don't know, I have, I love music. So <laughs> yeah, but honestly, just, I don't know, just kind of going outside is what I feel like seems to pass the time a lot. What inspired you to do YouTube? This one's actually a really good question. Um, I honestly just have always loved to talk. <laughs> I just like to talk. And um, I always like, thought a YouTube channel would be fun and I was like this year I was like you know what I've always wanted to do this and I've always wanted to like stick to a channel so this year I'm gonna do it I'm gonna stick to a channel this year and I'm gonna see how it goes and yeah and I've honestly loved it so far 
I just, I don't know, I just love watching YouTubers and then just seeing them do it. I'm like, I wanna do this. This looks like fun, let's do it. And so, yeah, honestly, just I just always kind of had a passion for it and always just wanted to do it. So I'm finally doing it now. Hey guys, so something I left out was um, somebody asked me how many siblings do you have? And I actually have three. I have one sister and two brothers. One of them is 17 and he's about to go off to college soon. And then my other one, we adopted him from China. He's 12 now and we got him from China two years ago. And yeah, he's doing pretty well, so that's good. And then I have a sister who's seven years old. What do you want to be when you grow up? Um, Honestly, that's kind of a hard one because I love fashion, so I kind of want to do something related to fashion. Whether, I don't, whether that's like a fashion designer or like having my own clothesline or like, I don't know, that's, maybe not having my own clothesline. That could be hard, but I mean, I could be able to do it. I don't know, though. Um, I, I really just want to do something with fashion. Not really sure what yet, but I've always kind of wanted to do something with fashion. So we'll see. Do you like anyone? I do, but I don't think they like me back. I'm like 90% sure they don't. So we'll see how that goes, I guess. <laughs> Favorite sibling? Uh, my brother asked me this one. Of course, um, I don't have one. <laughs> Favorite shoes you own at the moment? Honestly, probably my Air Force Ones because I wear those like all the time and they're so comfortable and they go with literally every outfit. And I've seen like on TikTok, like a ton of people are like painting them or something. And I saw one, I was like, I don't want to ruin them though. Like what if I mess them up? And uh, I don't know. So, but I saw this one where they put like j little jewels, like on the Nike stripe and stuff and on the little Air Force One thing. And it looked so awesome. And I was like, okay, I got to get some of these from the craft store and do this. Cause it looked, made the Air Force Ones look like so much better. The next one is how old do you think you'll be when you meet your soulmate? Um, honestly, I mean, I... I don't know it's like i can't really decide that i don't i mean <laughs> i don't know hopefully soon maybe i don't know i hope soon i don't know it's just hard to like say but i'm hoping maybe like when i'm 17 or 18 possibly i don't know we'll see i guess the next one is what's your mission every day or is there some goal you set for yourself every day um honestly probably just reading my bible every day because i'm not doing that and i really need to start reading my bible more often so even if it's not every day, just hopefully I can work my way up to reading it every day and staying committed. And yeah, I, that's honestly probably my number one thing that I really need to start doing better at. Favorite vacation? Um, probably when I went to San Diego, it was honestly so much fun getting to go to the beach and like hang out with my cousins and all that. It was so much fun. Yeah, honestly, I, I honestly just wish I lived in California. Like, I want to live in California so bad. I love California, and it's just so pretty there and stuff. I, I just, I love it there so much. Next one is, if you could have any domestic or exotic animal, what would it be? Um, definitely a meerkat, because I love them so much. They're just so small, and they're so sweet. I love them, and yeah, they would be the perfect pet, for sure. Can you tell us a favorite memory? Honestly, I can't just pick one. But one of my favorite memories that stands out to me the most is I, when I was on the beach with my cousins in San Diego and we were all just kind of looking off into the distance um, and we were all just like really calm and I don't know, there was just something about that one moment that just really sticks out to me for some reason. Well guys, this was it for my first Q&A video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to comment and let me know what you guys thought of this video and I hope you guys got to know me a little bit better because I really wanted you guys to just learn more about me and stuff like that. So yeah, don't forget to subscribe and I hope you guys stay safe, hang in there with this quarantine thing. I know everyone is getting so sick and tired of it because I definitely am, but hopefully this will all be over soon and we can all get back to our normal lives. Um, but yeah, I love you guys. Bye.